This is a UAV, an unmanned aerial vehicle, more commonly known as a drone. It is also an example of collaboration by two University of Hawaii at Manoa students from two completely different disciplines. Chuck Devaney is a graduate student in geography focused on high resolution aerial photography. To look at vegetation conditions in and around the island and also have a look at some of the uh, archaeological features. David Hummer is a PhD candidate in mechanical engineering. His focus? <laughs> building things. Being an engineer, you know, if it's uh, not broken, that means it doesn't have enough features. High resolution aerial imagery is expensive, especially for a graduate student. Before Devaney met Hummer, he had already taken to the skies in an attempt to make his life's work more economical. First we thought we were going to launch a rocket and tape a phone to it, and then that turned into uh, the whole kite effort. But kites need wind, which isn't always guaranteed. Eventually, a mutual colleague introduced Hummer to Devaney, and the Geography Drone Project took off. There is no telling where it may land. The UAV has given us a lot more uh, flexibility in terms of the entire environments that we can fly in, um, the amount of area that we can cover, uh, the stability, and um, it's just a lot of fun. They spent about $2,000 on materials, a frame, electronics, and cameras. If they bought something similar... The closest one we found is $50,000 for the package. So if we can fill, fill that, that part of the market and make it cheaper, then it seems like it'd be a pretty good, good idea. And it is a work in progress. Both continue to learn from their successes and failures while making advancements in their individual fields. You know, all the mapping and stitching and analyzing the photos, if I took years of school, I could do it, but you know, I'm, I'm, I'd rather build the airplane and work on that and then chuck focus on that part and together, you know, we can do something that neither of us could do without each other.